Hey guys, welcome back to the finale of Spongebob Squarepants the movie. We are going to turn the tables on Plankton. Alright, Krabs. Time for you to die. <laughs> Not so fast, Plankton. I brought back King Neptune's crown and I'm here to save Mr. Krabs. Nice work, Spongeboob. You made it all the way to Shell City and back. That's a heroic feat. Too bad it won't help. All hail. Plankton! Hey, King Neptune already has a crown! That's no crown, Patrick! It's one of Plankton's bucket hats! Plankton is controlling King Neptune! That's right! And now I'll have the pleasure of removing you along with your friends! Neptune, I command you to kill SpongeBob! Kill SpongeBob! All hail, Plankton! So here it is. SpongeBob versus King Neptune. Problem is, I'm a goofy gooba, yeah! That's a problem? Well, it's a problem for Neptune, isn't it? I suppose it is. Why are you wearing a blindfold? Me? Yeah. I'm wearing rocker shades, obviously. That is clearly a blindfold. Definitely, definitely like old-fashioned shades. Oh yeah, those are shades, you're right. It looked like a blindfold for how he was walking around with his hands all like, feeling things. I think that's just me rocking out. What is he even doing? Is that tartar sauce? Or what is that? Whatever is coming out of his trident looks like goop, or food goop, I should say. Doesn't really look that threatening. Looks like cheese, actually. I don't know why I said tartar sauce before. Tartar sauce is white. That looks like cheese. I don't actually know what I have to do to him here. Hit the table thing. Oh, you gotta reflect it back at him. You appear to be correct on that one. Oh, maybe turn all the tables. I'm turning the tables on Plankton, I guess. Get that Krabby Patty. This is gonna be close. I might as well just die and start over at this point. Mr. Krabs is just frozen right there. What, did you see my eyes pop out there? Yeah. <laughs> King Neptune is pretty cool, actually. I like the move that he does after he shoots the goop out of his trident. That's his laugh because he hit me. Oh yeah, it is. I like how the trident flies around him though, that's sweet. Couldn't Mindy help us out here? Possibly. One more over to your left. Are you sure? Yep. Right by that spotlight. That's a different spotlight. All the tables are different. Why is the spotlight on Mr. Krabs now? Was it always on Mr. Krabs? No. That's a pretty sweet song playing in the background. I'm surprised it's not playing the Goofy Goober song. I'm a Goofy Goober, yeah! I could have sworn that would be what I had to do. There we go. I have to hit that and it bounces off and hits him, I think. So you have to hit the target and it's going to reflect back? I have to hit the target that's behind him. Okay. I'm dead though. This might be pretty hard. I wonder what Patrick's doing right now. Yelling dodge, Spongebob dodge. Yeah, but where is he? Usually he's around. Remember the music video where he's just wearing like the fish not tights dancing around? Yeah. <laughs> That's probably what he's doing just up top. Patrick's all fun and games, but when there's work to do and a final boss to beat, he's off there messing around. I guess I shouldn't expect anything more from Patrick.
What? That's different. Oh, good. Get behind the target. You got a ricochet back at him or something? Mr. Krabs. Oh, yeah. I forgot about Mr. Krabs. There he is. Why did I not do this last time? I don't know. We might have missed one. Hit him now. Oh, no. Oh, no. Line it up. Oh, I think you got him. I did. So now you got to turn those again. This isn't that bad, actually. It's gonna be like five hours long, though. Right. <laughs> At least there's plenty of Krabby Patties to replenish your health. Because I can't run faster than the beam. The beam catches up to me. I mean, it is a magical trident, so... It almost looks like he's shooting like a flamethrower at me, doesn't it? Yeah. I like how Plankton's just flying around taunting you. You can hardly see the little bugger. You're missing a table somewhere. Or the game's bugged again, like last time, where I had all the tables and it didn't do that. No, you're missing a table somewhere. Then why is the spotlight of Mr. Krabs? That I don't have an answer for. What about that green light over there? Well, that doesn't matter. Just walk around the very far edge. We think you just have to wait him out there. Very nice, very nice. Take your time and line this up. Nice. Whoa. This is actually easier to dodge. As you get hit by it. Because <laughs> I'm not used to it. Cause this is just like something you see in like one of the older Mario games. Isn't it? Like one of the old Bowser fights in like Mario 64? Maybe. Actually I do know what you're talking about. With the rings and the ground pound. No, I don't know what you're talking about. But yeah. It's a typical platforming thing. Run, 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 run. This part's pretty cool. Rock his bucket off, Ethan. Oh yeah! You need a burger bag. You need a burger. There's no burgers left. Oh no, we might be screwed. Ooh, we're gonna cut forward till that part. Dude, I can't wait to see what King Neptune does to Plankton after he gets that bucket off of his head. Probably gonna freeze him. This is honestly Plankton's best chance to take over Bikini Bottom right here. He's never really wanted to take over Bikini Bottom, he just wanted the Krabby Patty formula though. Yeah, but this is better. It's just really out of character for him, it feels like. A little bit more diabolical than usual, but I like it. Nicely done, Ethan. Thanks. It'd be cool if you could get those sunglasses that he's wearing. You probably count as a costume if you get like all the extras. No, I mean like in real life. Oh, you might. I mean, I'm sure they exist. What? Oh, you gotta hit him in the head. I didn't hit him at all. He just stopped. You saw that, correct? Yeah, I think you gotta hit him in the head. I didn't get to hit him at all. I pulled the guitar out and he stopped wavering. Oh, maybe you're too close. Try using the guitar a little bit further back next time. Now oh, you're doing it. These energy beams got nothing on you. It's just like harder jump rope, which is weird. 
Oh, you really need a Krabby Patty. I think he's gonna stop doing this before I get a chance to hit him with it. It's weird that his Trident just has a scope on it. Sweet. What the heck is Mr. Krabs? Oh, there he is. I started running the wrong way at first. I just need to hit him here and then I'm good. Come on. Maybe a bowling ball would be better. Can't hit him without his bowling ball. You're gonna run out of time, this is your last chance. Nice. Whoa. Phase two? Oh, I'm gonna have to do jumps. Oh yeah, now it's time to rock. Cause we're a goofy goober, yeah! This is like Bowser now. This part is super cool. Plus it's got awesome jams. And Mr. I Spit Slippy Juice. This song is great. This song belongs on everyone's playlist. Of course it does. Is this a completely original song, or is it a cover of something else, I wonder? It's original, but it sounds like a different song. I think I'm gonna end up dying here. That's okay. You're a goofy goober. I think it might be better to do that dodge, honestly. Rah! Oh no, that resets them all. That doesn't count as a dodge. We were almost all the way through the song. I was loving it. Just jamming. You really just gotta get out of the range of that so you can focus on dodging the blue things. Dude, this end part is so cool. Just because of the song, though. <laughs> I love this song. Yes, you're dead now. Oh wait, no, I have to do this twice. You gotta find Mr. Krabs, always oh, right there. It's weird because it inverts it since you're looking from his perspective. Rock his socks off. Yeah! Plankton's like, this song is too righteous. I agree. SpongeBob's too righteous. That's true. Rock on, SpongeBob, rock on. Yeah, this is a parody of I want to rock. Okay. Dude is just tearing it up on the guitar. I mean, that's SpongeBob tearing it up on the guitar. That's what he does. Saves the day and plays sick jams. Oh, I might not get it this time. You got it. There's plenty of patties for you to eat. Nice. You just have to get out of the range of that. Oh, you're good here. Yeah! Alright, Mr. Krabs is right there. Two platforms to your left. Which will be your right now. Yeah, that's the weirdest part about this. Oh! No! And he gets his health back. I thought we were gonna win, but King Neptune had other ideas. You know, good on you, King Neptune. You busted SpongeBob, the goofiest of the goobers. Alright guys, one more hit. Here we go. This is it. Thumbs up for being a goofy goober, guys. And for taking out King Neptune. I know Ethan's gonna pull it off. I just know it. 
You can't put this pressure on me right now. The pressure is on Ethan. You can't you can't be saying stuff like that to put the pressure on me. Though. I just did it. Can you stop it? Please? Clutch City Population Ethan, let's go. I will fall into this pit like that if you keep on talking. <laughs> Intentionally or unintentionally. Hey, I gotta entertain the audience. The song's enough entertainment for them. You yeah, know it's song, true. Yeah, that song is spectacular. Oh, where'd that guy come from? These guys, they've been here the whole time. Have you not noticed? Uh-uh. That's what's been spinning at me the whole time. It's been making this hard. I've just been watching you jump over these electrical beams, and that's about it. That's the only reason I can't stand still when I'm over here. Okay, that makes sense now. I was wondering why you just didn't sit behind it. You need a Krabby Patty. There's none left. There's one way over there, and there's one over there. So you can get two. Nice. You're coming up on one. Yep. This is it, isn't it? Nope, one more dodge. Whoa. Come on, Ethan. There's Mr. Krabs right there. Yes! You got this? Booyah! I have to hit him still. Oh yeah. D don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Nail him. Yeah! <laughs> Victory Screech, baby! Idiot? Uh, no, no. Uh, idiot. <laughs> uh, French for a uh, handsome man. <coughs> Eugene Krabs, it looks like you were innocent the whole time. Oh well, that's why pencils have erased. And now to thank the brave heroes who recovered my crown and saved Bikini Bottom, SpongeBob and Patrick. You have performed a manly deed. I'm so proud of you. Thanks, Mindy. I've learned a few things about myself. I may be a dork and a wingnut. And a knucklehead McSpazitron. Yes, but more importantly, I'm a kid. And I like being a kid. I'm just glad that everything is back to normal. And so ends the most heroic tale ever told in Bikini Bottom. And as the sun sets over the island paradise above the waves, we must stop and wonder how long until the sequel depends on the box office. Now go outside and get some sun. You look awful pale. It's a good thing SpongeBob wrote this stuff down. So there you have it. SpongeBob SquarePants, the movie game. I hope you guys all enjoyed the playthrough. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up, subscribe for more awesome video games. Ethan, final thoughts. I'm a goofy goober. Yeah! yeah.